G'day gang, game while you're down here, how you going? Back in Lord of the Rings Online. Going back to Thorgast. To this little cracky store open. Got a lot of things to talk about, don't we, Athwald? First we'll start with you, Thorgast. Woe betide me. So it is done, and my brother's memory is avenged. Thank you, Game Olio Dan. It'll be far easier to go on with business knowing that my debt to Thorkel no longer weighs so heavily upon my chest. What to do now, though? These mountains have grown ever more dangerous in these past few years, and Halfwild is not the adventurous sort to join me on the hunt. Perhaps I will need to find a new partner, or give up on the hunt at last. I have no patience for the comforts of civilization anymore. I think I will stay here and take my chances with Worm and Wolf, man. Okay. Yes. Yes, sirree. I will take that right there. Make sure we equip that straight away. Little, little upgrade for us. Where's the other one? Yeah, I might replace that one. Block power, block ratings, but I get maximum power on the other one. So yeah, okay. Thought a guest. More. Whoa, Excellent game, Olio Dan. What should be that should be enough scales to satisfy my clients in Rivendell. It is hopeless. What are these? I I do not know what to make of them. I have no law to aid me. They have not come some way to cure me among their belongings, and my last hope is gone. Forgive me, I have no strength left. I must sleep now, and trust the faith that I will awaken again. Would that my brother were still here to watch over me? Hey mate, you can't sleep yet, I've still got two more quests here. I am beset by misery. Thank you, Game Audio Dan. You have taken a great burden off of my mind. What with all that has happened lately? Did you happen to see my brother Thorkel while you were wandering about? No? Oh, that's right, he's dead, isn't he? Sorry, I'm... I'm not in my right head. Don't feel so good. Woe betide me. Ah, uh, is this all the remains of my fair brother Thorkel? Was that I had fallen in his stead? But nay, I speak as a fool in my mourning. My dear brother was ever the warrior and adventurer. More so than I. He gave his life as he chose to save mine. And I'll never again gainsay his valor for doing so. Nor will I dishonor his name by failing to live as he chose that I should. It seems that I have much to do, Gable Dan, and wallowing in my grief while the merciless wind wears down these mountains will not get it done. Right. What is it that you have there? The Guardian Shaman carried it. It looks awful. The time has run out for poor Master Thorgest. Whatever that is, it cannot do any further harm. And if there is any chance it might save him, we must take it. Please, see to him immediately. Apply the Ice Fang. Alright, Thorgest. Let's give this a go. I am beset by mystery. What? What is this? You tried to poison me farther. It is horrible. Let me die rather than drink another drop of it. No, let me be. Just feed it to it. Oh, I've got to choose a quest reward. Okay, well, I guess. Uh... Lose vitality and I lose. I get maximum power, but I mean, my agility takes a big hit. 
What? Gah! Have you poisoned me yet further, fool? No. Wait, I, I, I think it's working. I can feel me toes again. By the beards of my forefathers, the taste was worse than the poison. Could you fetch a poor dwarf an ale to wash that down? No. No. But anyway, I'm, I'm glad that you're alright, Thorgist. How about a thank you, my dad, sir? It's okay. It's all right, Affold. What do you need? As long as he's feeling, but that's what's important. Perfect pies. Can't sell the perfect pies. that. Alright. So. With that done. Find the totem of challenge and defeat Black Fang. Alright, we do that. Which means we ride. So we've got our quest there. We've got our Goblin Towns. Oh. Oh, it's quite thuggy. Foggy. Foggy, not thuggy. <laughs> it's thuggy out here. What was I looking for? Uh... Eh... Well, we got this. That's just that's level 50. Let's hide that one for now. For now. For now is what I said. Anything here that I've got that has some reputation? I should have actually cleared this out and sold it while I was back there. Take that dagger. Get down, get down, get down. Dismount. <laughs> Alright, so we want to get to the top, I guess. Find the Dome of Challenge to defeat Black Fang. Well, when last time we came through here, we, uh... Didn't, don't remember a tournament challenge. But I'm sure it's there. Let's just fight our way up. Let's have a look at that dagger. Level 43, 59.6 DPS. I don't know, 60.9. Looking at the wrong thing. Uh, yeah. Let's throw it on. Lose agility. Oh, we'll, we'll give it a go. We'll just give it a go. Good about you, stalkers.
wonder if there's any melee rangers out there. Or hunters, melee hunters. Is it possible to make it, to have it as a viable option? Okay, there's a totem right there. Let's make sure we clear out all the stalkers in the area. seem to be anything hiding in the shadows, in the mists, in the fog, in the snow. Alright. Let's do this. The challenge has been issued. The temper swags. Oh, here they come. There's Black Fang. Do we have to take out all these wags as well? Oh, he wants to have a chat. Who dares? You are not of the pack, and yet you would challenge me? So be it. That's bad news for you, Black Fang. Ah, you want the elf? She means nothing to us. The goblin came and took her down into the caves. There she will remain. Now go. I will not see the back to one such as you. Challenge or no. Okay. So, back to Nogs. Oh, I love that. Look at that. Straight back here. Oh, yeah. Sometimes I, I level up, and I don't even notice I leveled up. <laughs> I got a point to spend. Quick shot focus. Uh, we might throw one more in there. Barbed Fury increases damage for any skill that deals damage over time. Well, that sounds pretty cool as well. I feel like I should just max this out. Or worrying about that. I might do that, and then I might go for Bob Fury. Or even this one. Alright. Greetings to you. Your tidings chill me to the bone, Game Audio Dan. Few are those who have escaped from the dark, twisted caves of Goblin Town once they have ventured within. The hatred of the goblins for my kin is great, and glow and torments will be long and cruel at their hands. We must prepare my stealthful force of arms to rescue her, or even should we lose a dozen heroes to the darts and blades of the goblins, still our suffering will be in as nothing compared to hers, should we leave her to their devices. Masterful mash. Ooh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's what it's about. Bit of masterful mash. Or is it? I don't know. Max power. Plus 42. 
I just don't like the idea of losing agility. Um, yeah, I'll just go with that. Down, down to Goblin Town. We're going down, down, down. Greetings, Will you lend to me Goblin ear? Town. So Black Fang revealed Glowen's fate to you before he was himself torn to pieces by his own pack. Hey, hey, we didn't see that. I deem it a fitting fate for such a monster, but not for poor Glowen. There is but one glimmer of hope that remains. The hatred of our goblins for my people is such that they will not kill Glowen if they can help it. They would much rather keep her in endless toil and torment until her will will to live breaks. And she either loses her mind or dies of her own accord. Luckily, Glowen is no faint maiden to be easily broken by such as they, and thus we may have some time to effect her escape. But I would not have her suffer a minute longer beneath at the tender mercies of the goblins. I've heard that Gloin, a dwarf yet still a friend, has set up a camp outside of Goblin Town. Find him and he will share with you what he knows of the depths and dungeons hidden beneath. Alright, I think it's happening. I think we're finally going down, down, down to Goblin Town. Um... But first, Did you need something? Don't sell my mash. Keep my mash. I'm gonna eat that mash. Uh, let's unlock that. It served us well. Let's loot all that business. I'll just have a quick look through it, see if there's anything that I might want to keep. What do you all think about crafting? Is it something I should actually start doing? Maybe on the side when I have time. I don't really don't have time, but you know, I mean, do you think it's worth it? For a person like me that's just adventuring through all this content and it's going to be doing it for probably a couple of years? Or is it something I shouldn't even bother with till the end? If I ever get there. It's not so clear. It's not so clear. Alright, to the camp. This should take us straight to Gloin. Okay, now everything's pointing to Goblin Town. So I think we're good. We're good to go finally. No dawdling. So many goblins. You say that there were more than enough for your blades, and I have no reason to doubt your word. I fear that my friend Walin might be right. The darkness reaching into the Blue Mountains may also be stretching here to the Misty Mountains. We must investigate further, my friend. That means you must go back into the darkness of Goblin Town. Welcome! You have come at a most fortuitous time. You well, you did well against those goblins, but something you mentioned has me concerned. I fear that the sheer number of goblins milling about at the entrance to the place is greater than I expected. It can only mean that they are stirred up to some task or afraid of something deeper in those accursed halls. It merits further investigation. Make your way back there, Game Olio Dan, and look for the Goblin Leader before the main hall. Something is amiss within those halls, and we must discover the truth sooner rather than later. If you find anything out of the ordinary, return to me so that we can put an end to it quickly. Greetings, Traveler. Will you stay a moment? Have you heard of the land of Orichel? It lies north and far to the west of here and is an impossible place filled with grinding ice and strange peoples. Though I've never been there, one of my cousins, Leitolf, recently led a group of my people up to Forachel to seek their fortunes trading with the Lossoth. If you were to travel to those lands, I would ask that you seek out Leitolf, Leitolf and ensure that he is safe. I've not heard from him in many months, 
though that is his way, coming and going for long stretches of time without correspondence to his kin. He said that he would be taking his caravan to Kalpa Kota, a strange sounding name for a town, isn't it? He said it lay north of the land of Evendim. Ah, oh, Evendim. True, Sirith Rear. The gate to the north. Uh, yeah, mate. Well, you want me to go Goblin Town. You don't want to send me north now. I mean, let's let's deal with one thing first, right? Gloin? Gloin? No, Godling. They think an elf is caught within the dungeons down beneath. Goblin Town has reawoken. I fear there's more than just one trapped in those depths. I do not remember where the dungeons are within. It has, was a long time ago. It will be up to you to explore and find where they are being kept. Alright. Well, we're not going to that place just yet. Uh, but maybe one day. Possibly. Once the uh, Misty Mountains have concluded. Let's make sure we got all the quests that we need, though. Why do I feel like I should have more quests? I think we... Oh, alright, because we handed a few in. Yeah, yeah, gotcha. Okay, well... I think it's time to hop on in. Thanks for watching, gang. If you'd like to show your support, please hit the like button. And I'll catch you in the next one.